everybody, what's going on? It's your boy Time. I uh, just kind of want to show you guys today a one week update on the new free to play account that I made one week ago today. So it's been a, probably a couple hours over a week, but whatever, close enough, right? So I just kind of want to show you guys what I've been able to do so far in a week. And I could actually do more, but I, I what I'm doing and what I'm realizing is if you're a new player, you really want to focus on all the limited things first because there's going to be a lot of stuff that's going to be like here forever right it's not going anywhere so anything that's you know outside of story because you do just you at least want to start unlocking you want to go through the story and unlocking summons as fast as you can um or at least start to have to have the chance to do it you know so you know basically coming through the story so i've managed to clear the story all the way up until summons i've done some of the extra ff7 stuff here um and then all the way to first soldier i've done some of that i haven't started i don't think i've started the new uh or the most recent uh, Crisis Core. I did like the story part, but that's it. I could probably come down here. It's been a while. It's been almost a week <laughs> since I've touched the story. Um, but I haven't been touching the story much because there's not as much to unlock at the moment in it that's useful. So yeah, I've, I've really seen how useful doing the story is because if you don't do the story, uh, you don't unlock a lot of these other things. So the second thing uh, I found I've been able to, you know, basically pushed crazy for <clears throat> was the golden bombs. So when I came in, the Golden Bomb thing only had a one one week left because it ended today. Um, so I can kind of show you guys my progress, what I've managed to do in one day, or one week, I'm sorry. So I managed to get all the way, this happened actually today. I was able to clear all the way up to the third Golden Bomb. I tried doing this unlock battle. I literally had like two minutes left before the end of the day. I tried doing it and I, I just couldn't do it. So even though it's got that recommended power level, you need like a really strong weapon or something to get you through it, like electric or wind. I just, I don't have that. I, I never picked up a Masamune, didn't pick up any other wind, big wind stuff. But that's not bad considering because I was actually stuck at this fight like the entire week. <laughs> like the bombs I could do no problem, right? Like bombs I did, I was able to clear all the co-op bombs. That wasn't too bad. But I could not beat the first guy here for a while. So I was like, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to focus hard, get some big weapons, and I'm going to go in. So that's what I did. So part of what helped me a ton, which I can't show you the, 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 um, can't show you the event because it's over. But these right here, I went as hard as I could trying to get at least these weapons from the Sephiroth event. This one I couldn't max out because, um, you have to clear like a, a fight that I just couldn't even get to. Um, which is it's not it's really not a big deal because if you look at the difference you're you're uh, it's not it's not gigantic Right, so I'm at level I'm at level 60 now, but just taking it to 90 would uh, would be huge So, you know, I'm not gonna get a huge boost like if I go to the enhance and see what I could get um, Or sorry the uh, over boost um, It gives me it gives me one more HP. So it's it's not it's not that big of a deal, right? So once a level goes up, it's basically going to give me the same stats. This only gets 10 more percent damage. So having it at OB9 is fine. Uh, I managed to get these to OB10. I was like, I need to get all the pieces for them. That took a lot of work. <laughs> so I, the final day of the Sephiroth event, I was chugging to get those done. Um, but here's kind of my breakdown of all my weapons so far. I don't have any big, super strong anything right now. Um, outside of really the event weapons. And it's really showing how useful the event weapons are. If you see this... I have every event weapon equipped in some way. Even the current ones I'm going through, I'm trying to get the Efreet ones, because again, their event weapons are their free weapons that have really good value. Especially this one here, the Inferno Grave, when I get a high enough level with the attack boost, that's going to be nice. And I'm going to go for the Ramu ones next. So, but yeah, trying to get your weapons up, uh, you know, find a good set that you need for your main characters. And having this AoE, I luckily I pulled this like not long after I started. This has been a godsend. If it wasn't for that, I wouldn't be able to clear as much content as I've been able to. Um, I've been pushing materia like crazy, trying to make sure materia is good uh, all the time. Um, I think so far the best materia I've gotten is probably this Blizzera. It's actually not bad. Four star Blizzera. I got a four star Fear of Blow, which is not very good, but it's four star and a four star early on. It's pretty good. So what I've been focusing on now, oh yeah, and I got this Quake Era Blow, but it's not so good. So that'll, <laughs> that'll end up being later on be trashed. Uh, but yeah, so materia hasn't been too bad. I haven't gotten anything major, but right now I'm focusing on just trying to try to get the three star materia um, and you know any fours that I can. Um, and then as far as the characters and their levels, uh, I can kind of show you guys here. So I, I went, what I did is <clears throat> using the bomb event, I was like, I'm not going to try to get everybody to, I'm not going to try to get one group to 70 because I'm like, I can get experience over time with them. So that's not a big deal, right? So, so what I did is my main group ended up being Cloud, Aerith, 
uh, and Sephiroth because I got, ended up getting really good wep solid weapons for all of them, right? Uh, with my secondary group being Zack. Uh, Zack is, is pretty much like he's definitely got a lot better stuff that I've pulled for him than I have anybody else compared to like the rest of the team. But Zack's kind of like my next guy up, followed by like Lucia and Tifa. Um, the other three I really haven't gotten much with. So as far as polls go, so I really haven't touched them. So as you can see, I, what I did is I got them to 60 and I was like, all right, I'm going to start getting these guys to try to get them near 60. So I got them in the, in the you know, low to mid fifties. So that way I need, if I need them for stuff, I have them, they're there and whatnot. Um, and then a lot of the web, I've actually been able to do pretty good on the premium quests. So premium quests, I've cleared all of the nano cubes. All of the genome pods in within the first week, which is pretty good, especially if anybody knows that Gallon Balor, that dude's a pain in the ass early on. So having having the knowledge of how to beat him has been like major helpful. Um, but you know, and I I guess I, I guess I can auto him now because I know how to what to do to set up for him, right? So uh, and I've gone through just trying to get all the memories and everything, get the gems from these. I haven't touched um, a lot everything yet, though. For instance, I haven't done a lot of uh, so weapon quests I've done because I've needed these things, but things I don't need, like some of the training quests, I still have a lot of these to go through. I haven't touched all of them yet. Um, like the blast one, I haven't done any of these these experience uh, ones, so I haven't done any of those yet. Again, these are things that are going to be there forever, so I'm not too worried about it. So that's again why I went hard and I dumped a ton of stamina into the golden bomb rush because I knew leveling up was going to be super important, especially early on. Uh, to get my growth up and then also the Sephiroth um, The Sephiroth event so and my draws have been kind of okay. Um, I have five here uh, it's Still left so I'm, I'm, I, I just wait till I have ten and that's when I go in um, and then as for the dungeons My criterion dungeons again. I could I could fly through these more. I just haven't done it yet um, I did the Logos ruins earlier today actually but uh, and then and then the crisis dungeons I'm trying to get to a point where I can maybe attempt one of each of these because there's a lot of crisis uh, medals to get out of those and I really want to get another buster sword because that just popped back up. And then, um, yeah, and then I got all these here. I haven't touched the hard ones, but again, these aren't going anywhere. So my thing is like, well, you know, I'm going to have to do them in order to unlock these. Like, like some of these, it requires you beat certain ones, right? So the hard modes. Um, so I'm going to have to do that if I want to even shot at them. These will be the easiest ones, the ones up, the very first ones that we ever had in the game. Those will be the, be the easiest. Uh, so, you know, I'll, I'll try my best. <laughs> but yeah, I've gotten through some of the Crisis Dungeons. I need to do more. Um, a lot of the reasons, big reason why I need to do more is I want some more of these, uh, some more of these, uh, Materia books. Because, like, this one's Breach. I don't really use Breach or Mana Breach. Uh, yeah, I really don't use those, so that's not a big deal. So I'm not, like, rushing to get that one. Um, can't even select that one. Yeah, so I have to get through the story more to unlock these. But yeah, that's kind of, I just kind of want to show you guys what's going on. Summon quests. Uh, oh yeah, let me show you summon quests. I still have, I can probably go a little further with this than I have, maybe. I haven't even attempted very hard a free, but maybe I should. That way I can unlock Hellfire, because that would be a big boost. I haven't even touched Shiva yet. I'm scared, <laughs> to say the least. Uh, plus I would like to have a defaith or something, have a defaith against her. Uh, would be huge, and I, I don't have that yet. So I think I have to get through story to get D-Faith. And then the tower. Uh, tower I've actually crushed through pretty well because I don't have to pay attention to it for the most part. Tower's been pretty easy. I think I'm on 40? 30. Okay. I haven't done 30 yet? Oh, okay. I thought I did 30. Maybe I didn't do 30. So I'm on 30. Uh, this is the one with the Iron Giant. I can probably actually finish this one. I think I goofed on my setup that I did with the last team. Um... But yeah, maybe I'll make another, uh, I'll make a video, a guide for that one. But the rest of them have been pretty simple um, for the most part, right? I'm using the same team across the board um, and then just crushing through these. So 30. I Right now, I could I could probably get up to 40. I'm thinking maybe higher because um, it's actually, the, the tower is a lot easier than, than the uh, recommended, the recommendation is. Especially because you get like the summon boost gauges and, and all you get all these different abilities and boosts, right, that help a ton, so... It should, it should help clear through a bunch. Uh, summon quest, story quests, I really haven't touched those. I did like one, uh, and that was clouds because it was like the very first one, so it's easy to do. Still have quests down here at the bottom. Haven't been able to finish them all, um, and, I, and I'm still just hanging on to my crystals. I haven't pulled on any banners yet. So this is completely bannerless so far. It's strictly just going through the events, getting things from events and whatnot, but 
yeah, it pretty much covers it. That's kind of the update. One week on the uh, on the banner here. And then also, thank you guys so much for 300 subs. We're at 300 subscribers now. So you guys are awesome. I appreciate it. Um, but yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys on the next video. Keep rocking. Catch you next time. Peace.